For some fans, it's the start of a new season. It's also the start of the Oregon Lottery's plan to launch a new mobile app that allows sports betting on games. KGW's Kyle Aboshi has uh, every, uh, some early details here. He joins us now in the newsroom. So when is this going to start? Uh, is it going to be for football season? Yeah, well, they hope so. The Oregon Lottery hopes to have it ready to go by the start of the NFL regular season. They're still doing some testing to make sure it works right and is secure, but they're hopeful by week one of the regular season. So I remember when I first heard this story that it, they were paying a lot of attention to NFL football as the launch date. But can you bet on other stuff besides NFL? Can you uh, bet on college football, for instance? No. So just the pros. But it's not just football. You can bet on all kinds of sports, including soccer, basketball, hockey. They say you can even bet on cricket. I have to learn the rules first uh, before I'm going to bet on that <laughs> one. Um, so how different is this from something some people might be familiar with, which is the Oregon Lottery Sports Action? Oh, right. You might remember Sports Action. It was launched back in 1989. It was a simple parlay game. This new app allows players to make all kinds of different bets on single games, parlays, there's prop bets. You can bet the over under. It's basically like a Las Vegas sports book on your phone, if you can believe that. So uh, let's talk about how it works on the phone. How do you, how do you pay? Do you attach it to a, um, a bank account, a credit card account? How does it work? Yeah, you load your account with a credit card, PayPal, connect it to a bank account, similar to kind of like the Starbucks app, obviously. Problem gambling is a concern, though. The lottery explained there are tools within the app to warn of risky play. There are pop-ups offering support and a number for the problem gambling hotline. Uh, we got a lot more on KGW.com answering all your questions. All right, Kyle, thank you.